last Undertale. It sure is the last... Probably the last episode of Undertale. Hey, where'd Sans go? Out to lunch. Hmm. I see. Look at Alphys. Hey, yo, is that the amount of time that you... Oh, I see the sign. I didn't notice that before. Hmm? Alphys. She oh. looks really weird from the front. Well, uh, what were you saying about the time? Uh, 9 45 48 yeah that's the time you yeah oh my god that's a lot of time i grinded more hours it's fine okay well let's get okay. started wow the ending you excited kind of oh my god look it's us Yeah. Papado chips. Papado chips. No uh, chips. Chips. Okay. Romy save. The end. Wow. <gasps> yeah. This is the barrier. This is what keeps all of us trapped underground. If, if by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. We're ready, right? Yeah, maybe not emotionally, up... but. Let me turn up my game volume, at least for myself. And I guess, you know, the viewers, you know? Yeah, you know, the viewers, you know. Uh, you know, the viewers, whatever those are. <laughs> uh. Oh, I did some weird thing there. Uh. My jaw kind of hurts whenever I try to open it. And so now it keeps popping when I'm trying to eat my Pocky in peace. And it's just like, ow. Let me get my controller in a nice comfortable location all right let me also open this and there all right we're gonna go to see the end wow hopefully things are better this time hopefully i see this is it then Oh, ready. A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Yeah, we are. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh. <gasps> hey, yo, is he okay? <gasps> <laughs> you just cut out like twice there. <laughs> Tario! Oh my god! Whoa! He should just beat up her, her husband. Oh, you boy, to Toriel. Okay. Hold on. What a miserable creature, torturing such a poor, innocent soul. Youth. Soul. I don't know. Why, I don't know. I don't know why I wrote that. You got souls on the brain. I do. Do not be afraid, my child. This is what she said at the beginning of the game. I know, I remember. <laughs> wow. It is I, Torio, your friend and guardian. Oh, mother. 
first, I thought I would let you make your journey alone. But I could not stop worrying about you. Your adventure must have been so treacherous. And ultimately, it would burden you with a horrible choice. To leave this place, you would have to take the life of another person. You would have had to defeat Asgore. However, I realize... I cannot allow that. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone leave here. Is that not what I've been trying to prevent this whole time? So, for now, let us suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. Oh, Hori. He's not that back. horrible. You're not Hori me, Dimor. Dreamer. Dreamer. Oh, God. My, my, my brain just, like, did not see the R. You know, it wouldn't be Undertale if Mitz didn't pronounce something weird. Shut up! Oh my god, I'm so sad. You pathetic whelp. Look oh, at him. Tutorial. Getting spicy? Look at him. Oh my god. If you really wanted to free our kind, you could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul taken six souls from the human, then came back and freed everyone peacefully. But instead, you made everyone live in despair. Because you would rather wait here, meekly hoping another human never comes. Tori, you're right. I am a miserable creature. But do you think we can at least be friends again? No, Asgore. Damn! Look at him! No! God. Please. Asgore! Human! Nobody fight each other! Everyone's gonna make friends or else I'll... I'll... Hello, I'm Toriel. Are you the human's friend? It is nice to meet you. Uh, yeah? Nice to meet you. Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? Jeez, that's rough, buddy. <laughs> hey! Nobody hurt each other. Oh, are you another friend? I'm Toria. Hello. Uh, hi! There's two of them? Hey, nobody fights with anyone. <laughs> if anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Hello. Oh, hello, your majesty. Hey, human. Did Asgore sh shave? What? Oh, I was so confused about that, but now it makes sense. Okay. And clone himself? Hey, guys, it's oh me, Sans Undertale. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> hey, guys, what's up? That voice. Hello. I think we may... <gasps> oh my god, I'm putting some pieces together. <laughs> know each other? I've connected oh, hey. the dots. I recognize your voice too. I am Toriel. So nice to meet you. Name's Sans, and uh, same. Oh, wait then. This must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It is so nice to finally meet you. 
Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowie! I can't believe Asgore's clone knows who I am! This is the best day of my life! Hey, Iris. Yum. Yum. What does a skeleton tile his roof with? Hmm. Snowproof roofed tiles? No, silly. A skeleton tiles his roof with. Shingles. Prumps. I changed my mind! This is the worst day of my life! <gasps> that is so mean! He just hates puns. So mean. Ah, come on, Asgore. It's gonna be okay. There's plenty of fish in the sea. Yeah, Asgore. Undyne's totally right about that fish thing. Sometimes you just got to, uh... Stop going after furry boss monsters and, uh, j just get to know a really cute fish! Mm. Yay! It's, it's a metaphor. Well, I think it's a, it's a good analogy. Let's kiss already, god. That's Metaton. Oh my god. Will you two just smooch already? Honestly, I've been saying that this whole time. The audience is dying for some romantic action. The audience is myths. <laughs> Anyways. God. Hey, shut up. Man. Yeah, that was voice crap. Man, the nerve of that guy. Right, Alphys? Uh, Alphys? No. He's right. Let's do it! <laughs> uh, well, uh, I guess if you want to, then... Don't hold anything back. Human. Why? Are they gonna like fucking make out and have fuck like <laughs> have fuck. Have fuck. Have <laughs> I was like, and like just do it right in front of me. I don't think that's what they were gonna do, but okay, you know, whatever. Oh <gasps> it's because she's homophobic. <laughs> Toriel homophobic. Toriel that's why, you know, don't be gay in front of the children, right? God. Uh, right, sorry, I got a little carried away there. <laughs> the gang's all here, oh my god. They are. My child, it seems as if, as if you will, must stay here for a while. But looking at all the great friends you have made, I think... I think you will be happy here. I will. Hey, that, that reminds me. Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides uh, her. Um, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know to call everybody? Let's just say... A tiny flower helped me. Oh. A <laughs> tiny flower? Oh, sorry, I thought he killed them. No, wait! No! You idiots. No! While you guys were having your little powwow, I took the human souls. And now, not only are those under my power, but all of your friends' souls are gonna be mine too. No! <laughs> and you know what the best part is? It's all your fault. It's all because you made them love you. All that time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them. Without that, they wouldn't have come here. 
And now, with their souls and the humans together, I will achieve my real form. <laughs> huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. If you win, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But this game between us will never end. I'll hold victory in front of you, just within your reach. And then tear it away, just before you grasp it. Over and over and over. <laughs> Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you your happy ending. I'll bring your friends back. I'll destroy the barrier. Everyone will finally be satisfied. But that won't happen. You. I'll keep you here no matter what. Even if it means killing you one million times. <laughs> what? Not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, we will always be there to protect you. Oh, that's right, human! You can win! Just do what I would do. Believe in you! Oh. Hey, human! If you got past me, you can do anything! So don't worry, we're with you all the way. Huh? You haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on, huh. this weirdo's got nothing on you. Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him. But, somehow, I know you can do it. Human, for the fu- eh, Human, for the future of humans and monsters. You have to stay determined. Oh, hey! Hey, yo, it's everybody! Uh, no! Unbelievable! This can't be happening! You! You! I can't believe. You're really all so stupid. All of your souls are mine. <laughs> it's the kid. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Finally, I was so tired of being a flower. Howdy! Olive, are you there? Hey. It's me, your best friend. Oh. Asriel Dreamer. Hey. It's the end. What do you want to do? Uh Okay, well, like first of all, why would why would this child want to kill his parents? We'll figure that out. We just have to beat him first. Oh, uh dude. Oh. You held on to your hopes. You reduced how much damage you'll take this turn. 
Oh, it's this attack, okay. Yeah. I still haven't really processed that I'm playing this, huh? You haven't. Jeez. Okay. Look at his name. I see, it's it's Rainbow. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> oh. You kept holding on. Damage reduced. You know, I don't really care about destroying this world anymore. Oh. oh. Yeah. Let me have a burger. Burger. Mm, Borg. Borger. After I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to reset everything. kept holding on. All your progress, everyone's memories, I'll bring them all back to zero. Oh, I- I checked the recording! <laughs> Whoa! Okay. It's fine. What, what happens if you dream? Uh, I'll show you. You kept holding on, Dan introduced. Then we could do everything all over again. I'll show you after I eat, like, these yeah, chips. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, um... Papado chips. Papado chips. And do you- And you want to know the best part of all this? You'll do it. Oh? oh. Yeah. I put myself in a corner! Okay, it's fine. You know, I'll show you after- this one. <laughs> and then you'll lose to me again. Ah. Okay, dream! You think about why you're here now. You can feel so the empty space in your inventory getting get smaller and smaller. Oh? And again. Oh yeah. Uh, let's check our inventory. Look! Dreams! Oh? Hey, I wanna see what that is. Through determination, the dream be became true. Your HP was maxed out. Oh? Yes. Interesting. And again. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna... <laughs> You kept holding on because you want a happy ending. I do want a happy ending. You sure do. I mean, it's understandable to want a happy ending, you know? Yeah. Time to hope. Because you love your friends. I do love my friends! It is, like, your main trait. Uh-huh. Ow. 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 I'm gonna die. Ayo! Ayo! Uh, let's have a dream. Because you never give up. I don't. It's called determination, asshole. <laughs> I'm filled with determination, dick. Exactly! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Isn't that delicious? I mean, is it? <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't know. Your determination, the power that let you get this far, it's gonna be your downfall. Oh?
now. Enough messing around. It's time to purge this timeline once and for all. Wait oh. a minute. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... Uh, oh, that's freaky. It is. Even after that attack, you're still standing in my way. Wow, you really are something special. But don't get cocky. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my real power. Just like Shaggy! Just like anime! <laughs> Just like anime Shaggy! You're right! Oh my god. Let's see what good your determination is against this. Wide. Asriel oh, blocks the way. I can't move my thing into items. It's not letting well, me. Time to die, I guess. Struggle. Can't no, move your please body. please don't hurt me. I, I can't move. <laughs> Behold my true power. Hey, I'm gonna like die, uh, dude. Boop. But it refused. Ayo, determination! Ayo! I can feel it. Every time you die, your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. No! Your life will end here, in a world where no one remembers you. Still, you're hanging on. That's fine. Yeah, it's called determination, asshole. <laughs> in a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well in your next life. Ow. Can't move your body. <laughs> Still, come on. Show me what good your determination is now. I will. Can't move your body. Nothing happened. You struggle. Nothing happened. You tried to reach your save file. Nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file. Nothing happened. It seems saving the game really is impossible. But, maybe, with what little power you have, you can save something else. Save? Who do you want to save? I want to save everybody! I know, who do you want to save first? Uh... No, Torio! Re you reached out to Azriel's soul and called out your fr to your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? With the within the depths of Azriel's soul, something's resonating. The lost souls appear. Lost soul. I wanna hug her. You hug the lost soul and tell her that you're going to see her again. Something about this is so familiar to her. This is for your own good. Forgive me for this. Whoa. Uh, when it says mercy, are you asking them for mercy, or are you giving them mercy? It just says mercy. And what does preference mean? You want to figure out? I don't know. I, if it's something bad, and I don't want to do something bad to them. I'll tell you right now, none of these options are bad. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's do it. You tell the lost soul your preference. Uh... Uh, you tell the lost soul that you prefer cinnamon instead of butterscotch. Aww. Somehow, she faintly recalls hearing this before. No one will leave again. This is my duty. <laughs> duty. Ha ha ha. I'm joking. Oh my god, you're just like Vanellope from Wreck-It Ralph. God. Talk. 
You tell the lost soul that you're going to save everyone. Something stirs deep within him. Oh. Hug. I'ma hug him. I, I Suddenly, will. his memories are flooding back. Our, you are our Your fate future. is up to you now. Oh. Who we okay, save in Sans. the next? Okay. Sans! Undertale! Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. What do you want to do to old Pappy? I want to- <laughs> Don't insult him, that'd be too mean. I want to <laughs> joke with him. You told the lost soul a bad pun about skeletons. He seems to hate it, but the other lost soul seems to like it. Just I must give up, I did. Ah, uh, I, I forgot, there's gravity. Recipe. You asked the lost soul to cook something for you. The lost soul Spaghetti. is trying to hide its joy. Why even try? And everyone will! Oh, what? Oh. <laughs> um, joke, yeah. You told the lost soul a bad pun about skeletons. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. <laughs> nah, I'm rooting for you, kid. No, wait! You're my friend! I could never capture you! All right. Lost soul appeared. Oh, she's in her dress. Mhm. Mm uh, I want to nerd out. Yeah. You ask the lost soul what her favorite cartoon is. She can barely hold back from giving you an enormous answer. You hate me, don't you? No. I hate that guy though, Metaton. But not you, Elphus. Jesus. Okay. Um. Call? You call the last soul on the phone. She starts to sweat. She doesn't know why, but this all seems very familiar. I've got to keep ly lying. Uh, uh. There was something in my throat. <laughs> Uh, encourage. You tell the lost soul that you're, you'll continue to support her. Suddenly, she remembers. It's all flooding back. No, that's not true. My friends like me, and I like you too. Oh! Oh, Undyne. Ah, uh, yes. You with that... Um, that <laughs> waste. <laughs> uh, okay. I um, hate it here. I'm gonna tap her. You tap the lost soul lightly. Something about the way you fight is familiar to her. All humans will die. Uh, clash, I think. You clashed against the lost soul with all your might. She feels your fighting spirit. It's familiar somehow. You are our real enemy. Am I? Smile? You gave the lost soul a big smile, like you remember, uh, like you remember she likes to do. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. Well, some humans are okay, I guess. Save Asriel. Yeah. Strangely, as your friends remembered you, something else began resonating within the soul. The strong, stronger and stronger. It seems that there is still one last person that needs to be saved. Asriel. But who? Suddenly, you realize. You reach out and call their name. Huh? What are you doing?
you feel your friend oh. souls resonating within Asriel. Bam. Yes. What? What did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? No, no, I don't need anyone. Oh God. Oh, yes, he does. Oh Christ. <laughs> Stop it! Get away from me! Do you hear me? I'll tear you apart! Not with that. <laughs> oh. Olive, do you know why I'm doing this? Why I keep fighting to keep you around? It's because I died. And that's okay. I'm doing this because you're special, Olive. You're the only one that understands me. You're the only one who's any fun to play with anymore. Oh? No. That's not just it. I- I- I'm doing this because I care about you, Olive. I care about you more than anybody else. I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. Oh. Bruh. So please, stop doing this and just let me win. Stop it! Stop it now! Oh! <laughs> Olive... I'm so alone, Olive. I'm so afraid, Olive. He was a baby. Olive, I... I... I'm so sorry. He's just a baby. I, I always was a crybaby, wasn't I, Olive? I know. You're not actually Olive, are you? Olive's been gone for a long time. Um, what? What is your name? Frisk? That's a nice name. Did you piece it together? Mm. The child we named at the beginning wasn't us. It was the dead one. Uh, mm. Interesting. Frisk, I haven't felt like this for a long time. As a flower, I was soulless. I lacked the power to love other people. However, with everyone's souls inside me, not, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other monster's as well. They all care about each other so much, and they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone feels about you. Papyrus, Sans, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel. Monsters are weird. Even though they barely know you, it feels like they all really love you. <laughs> Risk. I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. Of course you forgive him. He's a child. Forgive. What? what? Chris, come on. You're you're gonna make me cry again. Cause 
Besides, even if you do forgive me, you can't keep these souls inside of me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire. With everyone's power, with everyone's determination, it's time for monsters to finally go free. He's levitating. Tea posing, even. Yo! The barrier was destroyed. Risk. I have to go now. Without the power of everyone's souls. I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. So, Frisk, it's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just go be with people who love you. I want to give him a hug. Comfort him. It's a baby! to let go. Riss, you're, you're going to do a great job, okay? No matter what you do, everyone will be there for you, okay? Well, my time's running out. Goodbye. <laughs> By the way, Frisk, take care of mom and dad for me, okay? I think that's you, yeah. This is all just a bad dream. Please, wake up. Oh! Oh, you are awake, thank goodness. We were so worried. It felt like you were out for... forever. Yeah, any longer and I would have freaked out. Tell us next time you decide to take a nap, okay? Yeah, you made Papyrus cry like a baby. What? I didn't cry. I don't cry. I just caught something in my eye. What did you catch? No, no. The important part is that Frisk is alright. Here, Frisk. Why not drink some tea? It'll make you feel better. Er, uh, how about we give them space first? They must be very exhausted. Though, from what I am not certain... Frisk, we do not remember exactly what happened. There was a flower, and then everything went white. But now the barrier is gone. When you are ready, we will return. We will all return to the surface. 
It seems the door to the east will lead us there now. But before then... Perhaps you might want to take a walk? We will take a walk. I will take a walk, it sounds nice. You can say goodbye to all your wonderful friends. Do as you wish. We will all wait for you here. Oh, my friend! Hello, Fuss. Alpha's upgraded my phone. I'm having a lot of fun with the texting feature. Sans, check out this one. Oh man, Tori. That's brutal. I can't believe the queen has returned! And also that she's a huge dork! You two are two feet away from each other! Why are you texting?! Worry not, Papyrus. We are texting for a good reason. Why is that?! Well... Because we're huge dorks. Sans, please do not say that. You are not a dork. You are more of a bonehead. Thrumch. <laughs> wow! Those puns are even less funny coming from her! Then why are you smiling? It's a pity smile! Oh hey, what's up, Frisk? We were just talking about you. Apparently, you asked to call Tori mom right after meeting her? Well, it was not right after. It took a couple minutes. Frisk, I gotta tell you. That's, uh, not the best way to get to know someone. It's not? Papyrus, we've been over this. Whatever, mom. Oh. Don't talk back to me like that. Go to your room, Papyrus. Okay, Undyne. Wait, no. Don't actually go to your room. I'm getting mixed messages here! The average God, gay me friend of group. Goldie. Huh? The average gay friend group. Honestly. So, Asgore. How about making me a member of the Royal Guard? Well, Papyrus, now that the war is over, we might not need a, the Royal Guard anymore. What?! Then what was the point of the human's quest?! They journeyed all this way! And I'm still not a member of the Royal Guard?! Truly! This is the worst possible ending! I'm pretty sure it's far from it, but okay. So, Alphys, what do you want to do now that we're all free? Yes. We have the yes. whole world to explore now. Yes. Well, I I'm going to go out and, um, no, I should be honest. I'm going to stay inside and watch anime like a total loser. God. That's the spirit! Everyone, a celebration to be to being losers. <laughs> the virus has the right idea. Losing to Frisk is the best thing to ever happen to me. So I'm glad that we, huh? What is it, Asgore? Um, what's in anime? Oh no! Oh my God, Frisk, please. Help me explain what anime is to Asgore. You see, it's like a cartoon, but... It's with swords. I, I haven't seen that many, like, animes with guns. I'm sure that they exist. I, I know that they they actually exist. But the ones with swords are so much more iconic. Yeah, but what about the the sister anime to Sword Out Online? Gun Gale. Gun Gale um, Online? Yeah. Well, look, listen, I haven't watched the entirety of Gun Gale online i've just seen sword art online so just i'm just saying swords are cooler than guns that's it yeah so it's so. like a cartoon but with swords golly yes that sounds neato where is this where can i see the anime 
Oh god. Hold on, I think I have some on my phone. Here, look at this. Oh, uh, oh, we... that, that, that's the wrong... Uh, never mind. Golly, were those two robots... kissing? Are we gonna ignore the fact that Alpha has robot erotica on her phone? Mmm. Maybe that's why she built Metaton complaints. I hate it here. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, technology sure is something, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it sure is. Oh my god, Alpha just kissed her already. Is, um, you gotta tell me. Do you think Asgore and Toriel are, uh, ever gonna get back together? I don't think they will, but I really hope they will. Does that make sense? Uh, what, like, you're like a child with divorced parents? It's, it's realistically, no, they won't, but optimistically, yeah. Which one do you want to say, though? I would just say no, not to get the hopes up. Because, you know, if, if you say no, if you say no, you know, like, then all you can really do is be, um, what's it called? Like, either pleasantly surprised or, like, uh, accepting because you already thought that was going to happen, you know? But if you say yeah, yeah then you're, the only place that you get is either being right or disappointment. Yeah, that's what I thought. A woman can dream, though, right? And write fan fiction. <laughs> oh. <laughs> sorry, sorry. It's just you don't write fan fiction about people in real life, especially people that you know. I like, wrote fan fiction about Froggy and, <laughs> and Bunny. No! Writing that's fan so fiction horrible. about you and me. No! Uh, uh, hmm? Huh? Hey? 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 Break and up with your girlfriend? Oh! <laughs> A lot of fan fiction. That's weird. It is. Howdy, Frisk. Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. I feel very bad about it. Oh. I hope we can still be pals. Hey, don't worry about it, Asgore. I think everybody's tried to kill Frisk at least once. Oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry, Frisk. I'm not what? sorry, Frisk. <laughs> Asgore, that's not what I meant. God. Uh, oh, hang on. Now that yeah. Toriel can use her phone, I can... Notice you received a text from Toriel. Dear Frisk. Ugh. Sans and Alphys are teaching me how to text. I'm learning so much. For example, do you know what a smiley is? Please, look at this. Oh, it's a baby! Now turn your head to the left. It's a picture of me smiling at you. Can you see it? L-O-L. That stands for lots of laughter. That's not what it's- okay. I'm not gonna- <laughs> Sincerely, Toriel. That's all for now. Maybe in the next room he will receive another. Toriel sent you a first. message. How are you? How- you have been wandering around for quite some time now. It's been a second! <laughs> I hope you're not getting into trouble. Only kidding. LOL. Sincerely, Torio. P.S. Do not get into trouble. <laughs> uh, I want Torio as my mom. God. Excuse me. I did not mean to write sincerely. 
I meant to write sincerely spelled correctly. <laughs> it is difficult to use this with which with <laughs> oh, Hold on, sorry. <laughs> Do with... over. Sorry. <clears throat> It is difficult to use this with large hands. Perhaps I should ask Sans to s transcribe for me. Her large maternal hands. Good for patting heads. Good for patting. Good for holding hands and doing the thing where like somebody can cup your face with their hands and it's nice and warm and soft. Anyways, Sans will be typing from now on. Undertale. Under the tail. Hey Frisk, it's Toriel! I just baked a... Let me count that numbers. One million pies! Million. Do you want any? Make sure to brush your teeth before crossing the street, Frisk. I don't think that was Toriel. I don't know, what it's do just the just the feeling. I did not say any of that. <laughs> I knew it. What do you mean? Toriel has a much more polite manner of speaking. Greetings. Oh. Yeah, no, it is her. Greetings! This is Sans. I love my brother very much. Help, I'm being Help slandered. Oh, that's not. Help, God. <laughs> Shut up! Imagine. They're all fighting over the phone. <laughs> Actually, I could have gone the easy way. This is hey. Sans. Frisk, did you know that I love getting owned? I think Toriel is very good at- <laughs> Anyways. Excuse me. What? Okay, let me go the easier way. Because I don't want to walk through this again. Uh. Ah, oh, no, the easier way is right past here. I spent unnecessary time! Oh my god! Pain. Toriel sent oh. you a message titled Cat Video. Inside, she... <laughs> Meticulously describes a video she saw of a small white animal. There's no link or attachment to watch it. Oh, She's like a boomer. Yeah. Alright. Ford, send this to someone you care about, or a skeleton will rattle his bones at you. Oh, yeah, like yeah, a I boomer. think she got hacked. Dear Frisk, thought you might enjoy this. Mm. Oh, nice. Sorry, we aren't allowing any more guests at this time. Or ever again. Is there anyone in the- in the... Hey look, the dad- the terrible father is gone. <laughs> Thank God. Oh, let's see what Brad and Caddy have to say about all this. Freedom. Uh, freedom. 
I think you were the left one. I thought I was catty, but okay. All right, you were catty because you were you were like, oh my god, cat girl. <laughs> Yeah. So we're like totally free now, huh? Yeah, yeah like totally free. Like cool. Yeah, like cool. Like very millennia of being in prison finally over. Yeah, like that's pretty chill, I guess. I uh, hey, I'm about to come out. I'm human. <laughs> come out to them. Oh, oops, really? Uh well, when we said um we were hyped for the destruction of humanity, uh, we were just, like, joking, you know? Did we say that? Probably. It's, like, practically our catchphrase. <laughs> really? I thought our catchphrase was... But, but bratty and the best c c caddy's the coolest. Um, oh. no. We're like, l we like literally never said that. <laughs> Can it be though? Can it be? Future. Hmm, now that we're gonna be free. Oh my god, we can finally fulfill our dream of having a pet cat! Uh. That's like your dream, Caddy. But, Braddy. I don't want to have a dream without you in it. Okay, gay ass. Aw, catty. And in my dream, you clean up after the cat. Catty! Do you like cats? Man, just kiss already. Me? Yeah, I love cats. Me? Yeah, I love cats. They're like so tasty. They're like so cute. <gasps> <laughs> Sorry, that's, that's just how I feel. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Kind of. Anyway, when was the last time you even saw a cat around here? Oh, just the other day. There was this cute little white cat walking around. It was like, so clueless looking. I pet it for like an hour. Caddy. Yeah, Braddy? I think that was like a dog. <laughs> Dogs are just firm cats. Weird take, but okay. Oh yeah, we could talk to Burger Pants. Yeah. Oh, let me see what no! Dear Frisk. Undyne and Papyrus want to cook something together with me. Sans is telling me that they are excellent chefs. I mean, <laughs> I'm excited. <laughs> Maybe if you're lucky, you can have some. The collab we need. You were Burger Pants. Ew! He's so funny though. Freedom! Ah, uh, I don't remember how I voiced him. Um. It... So we're free, not... huh? Metaton told us that as much. Then he told me, don't think that means you're getting out of work early. Damn capitalist. Hello? Hello. Okay, you heard what I said, right? Yeah. Okay. For some reason, it like it it uh it froze on me. That's it. <laughs> Capitalism. Oh, there's a line. Oh well, I guess it is frozen on me still. Hold on, let me stop watching and go back in. Ah, uh, my boss. I love that guy. And by that, I mean I hate him so, so much. Same. Me when I had a job. Bruh. Okay. Braddy and Caddy. So we're free now? Does that mean my double date is cancelled? 
I know, it wasn't really a, a date. Here's the trick, little buddy. Lie to yourself all the time. It makes you feel better. Well, freedom. Don't tell anyone this, little buddy. Because they'll make fun of me. But I, I feel like I played a hand in everyone getting free somehow. Even if it was just working this awful job. I think I did something. Technically he did. He gave us food that helped us in battle. Yeah. I don't know if it's true, but I believe it anyway. Future. Little buddy, there's a brand new world out there waiting for us. I'm sure with my <laughs> qualifications, it won't be long before I'm a famous movie star. Or maybe I'll just end up flipping burgers again. Ah, yes, the likely outcome. But it's as I say, nowhere to go but up, literally in this case. Water. Let's do a little tutorial home. Dear Frisk, if Sans and I started a band, do you know what we would call it? Dreamer and Femur. L O L. P.S. That is only a joke. Do not refer to me as Dreamer. Ah, uh, yes, because that's your ex husband's name, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited to sell nice cream on the surface. All human if all humans are like you, I think it will be really popular. You can voice this one. One guy Undyne told us the Royal Guard is being disbanded. Like bummer. Guess we'll have to get used to love and peace. Oh, you'll love all right. He seems happy. Ship them. Cannon. Cannon ship. What? Do you want a rematch? We're free. You don't need the. Actually, yeah, we'll take the long way, you know, walk around. Unless, hmm. Nah, I'm lazy. Let's go to Waterfall. Tra la la, humans, monsters, flowers. Do you think, um, the boat person is going to be, um, doing boat services in the, s in the surface? Who can say? You- you voice this one. What? God, okay. Fluffy buns, why? Oh yeah, he was all like, oh yeah, we called the king Fluffy Buns. Yeah. Okay, okay, I remember it clearly now. It was the monthly address at the castle, and the queen was giving her part on current events. After finishing her update, she moved the to pass the... Fuck, hold on. Oops. I need to read. <laughs> after... <laughs> after visiting... After... <laughs> Why can't I read? It's fine. Okay. After finishing her update, she moved the to pass the microphone to the king. However, she didn't realize the microphone was still in her hands when she said, Your turn, fluffy buns. Well. Well, 
the audience burst into laughter. That's so pure. Realizing what she had said, she started laughing too. After a few moments, the king held up his arms. The crowd grew silent. He leaned towards the microphone, expression turned. Dear citizens, thank you for coming here today. I, King Fluffy Buns, and the rest is history. Why is Asgore a goat? Well, eh? Goat? Actually, that reminds me. Toriel once wore a flower pattern, Moo Moo. Folks kept saying, nice Moo Moo to her, and she kept thinking they were calling her a cow. Oh, that's... So she never wore it again. That's so mean. What was the question again? Oh, right. Asgore. He's a re He's a real interesting type of monster. The strongest type of all. We call them boss monsters. When they have an offspring, the soul power of the child flows into a... Wait, wait, wait hold on. When they have an offspring, the soul power of the parent flows into the child. Causing the child to grow as the parents age. But Asgore doesn't have a child. So he's been stuck at the same age. Probably will forever. Uh. Huh? What if the child is a human? What? Nah. That wouldn't work. So if Asgore is your father, he'll definitely outlive you. That is so sad. Yeah. I mean, wait, okay, so that doesn't make sense, right? So, okay. He had a kid, but the kid's dead. Oh, yeah, the kid yeah, can't yeah, yeah. outlive yeah. him. <laughs> and the kid can't take true. his energy. Wait, so for the whole life, the kid's taking their parents' energy? Yeah. Damn, that's why I don't like kids. <laughs> Bro, parasites. Reason, reason number 155 to never have children. Asgore and Toriel. Asgore and Toriel. Oh yeah? Of course. Toriel was queen and Asgore was the king. It was tragic when she left. Since everybody knew she was really the brains behind the throne. My girl! <laughs> but it was also a teeny, teeny bit revealing, you know? Those two were really insufferable together. Nuzzling the noses, being all cute and cuddly in public, embarrassing their children. Oh. <sighs> they were so sweet, it made me sick. Thank God those days are over. My dude, do not root for their divorce. Bruh. Undyne. Undyne? She's really come a long way since she was a, li er, a little urchin. I used to be a hero myself back in the old days. I don't know if it's Gerson or Jerson, but Jerson, the hammer of justice. When she was younger, Undyne would follow me around to watch me beat up bad guys. Sometimes she even tried to help. Though most of the time, the folks she attacked weren't bad guys. It'd be a, the mailman or something like that. Anywho, I'd appreciate it. I appreciated it. <laughs> Be careful out there, kid. <gasps> oh, that's a blue. Gen Metaton. Ugh. Oh, Metaton. I'm a huge fan. Oh, hi. Human. I'll never forget when you cheered me on. When I was pretending to sleep. No one have e had ever been... Eh, no one had ever had so much faith in my fake sleep. Uh, also, this is awkward, but what's your name? Everyone seems to know it now except me. Seems like I've been missing out lately. I was just sitting at home listening to tunes. There was a flash of light outside my window. I saw the snails on the farm disappear. 
and I heard a knock at the door. The flash of light wanted me to come in. I closed the blinds. Now everyone knows your name except for me. Friss? Oh, okay, I won't forget it. There you are, Frisk, darling. Feast your eyes. Dr. Alf has completely, you know, completed my wonderful new body. Oh, and did you hear? The barrier's open. I can't wait to see the sun. The greatest spotlight of all, I guess. Oh, yes. I suppose I should, I should thank you too, darling. Before fighting you, I had forgotten how fun it was to perform with others so I've been searching for hot talents to fill up my upcoming trope Troop. so far Shiren's agreed to be my backup singer and the Natsa Blue here will be my sound mixer the three of us performing together it really feels overdue, doesn't it? Man, remember? Remember that time that we burned down Undyne's house? Is it still there? Oh yeah, you want to see it? It's probably like all just trash. Yeah. It's still on fire. Dummy's uh -oh. here. So you helped us all free. I guess I really acted like a dummy to you. Bruh, why is nobody helping the house? Eh, you know, fire loose there now. Okay. Dog! Snowed in. Piano plays the the tinkling sound. Mm, tinkling. Doesn't tinkling just mean pee? I mean, it could. Okay. Come again sometime. Ah, the rock people. Anyway. Yeah. Oh, the ice wolf's done. Ice Wolf no longer has to throw ice. Ice Wolf can take break uh, to buy some pants now. He's naked! Yeah. Oh, we're free? Finally, I'll be able to stop smiling. Oh. You can voice this one. Looks like I don't have to worry about crackling, cracking jokes anymore. I was going to say a joke here, but I really don't have one. I wonder if the overworld has a hot guy and the drinks. Ugh, I'm ready. You can read this one. Soon I'll be able to try some human food. And then I guess I'll try a human bathroom too. Hey, people wanna people won't have to move in from the city anymore. Seems like we won't have to lose our local culture. Except we're all moving out of here, huh? Oh well. Guess it can't be all punk peaches and punk cream. Okay. Good job. And I never caught any girls on my fishing line. So kid, take it from me. Don't try to catch hot people with a fishing rod. Somewhere you hear a whining, a, a whine, a whinny, whinny of dismay. You can read. Wow, a brand new world. I might not get to translate for Grillby anymore. Which is fine, since I was actually just making up what he was saying. Well, well, it finally won a game of poker against itself. Oh, lesser dog! 
Congrats! Oh, I forgot. We didn't check out Temi Village. We could check that place out, like, near the end. Hmm. Now our parents are, are the same entity. Does that mean I'm married to my sister? What? What? Because they were all merged. Remember? The termination. The experiment. Every single dog in existence? Well, at least those parents. Those dogs' parents. Mm. Awful. Wait. We're dogs. That stuff's normal. No! <laughs> Nothing but constant pain. I don't like that. That's okay. All of our parents have combined into one horrible being. That's okay though. It's really brought our families together. I hate this so much. Having an amorphous shambling family member is great. They're always moving, so I could see them 100% of the time. Uh, that's. Just... I don't think they're Weird. in here, yeah. Oh, well, yeah, let's talk to the monster kid. They've been with us the whole time. Yo, what's up? I've been kind of doing some thinking. Maybe Undyne is actually isn't actually as cool as we thought. She's just kind of mean. But yo, I found I just found out about someone way cooler. Nyehehe. <laughs> oh god. They we have a, we have a role model. Uh. What happened? Hmm. Nom, 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 nom. You voiced huh? this character oh. last time I remember. I mean, it happened to you, right? There was a strange flash of white light. Then I felt my body being pulled into something. Then, suddenly, everything was back to normal. Human. I heard that it was all because a human came through here. A human? I can hardly believe it. Well, if they decided to stop in, I'd be sure to give them a hero's welcome. I mean, this might come as a surprise to you, ma'am, but uh... Ruins. Did you hear? The ruins have been opened up, and get this! They were opened from the inside! Apparently, the queen's been staying inside there for god knows how long. Pretty unbelievable, huh? Future. Well, I suppose I'll move my store into the overworld. Haven't planned much more than that, I'm afraid. <laughs> the overworld? Like Minecraft? <laughs> Bruh. We haven't been in the ruins ever since the beginning of the game, huh? We sure haven't. Don't tell me we're gonna see Flowey there. Well, I guess. Maybe someone on the surface will pay attention to me. There's so many people. Someone has to, right? Good luck with that. Bruh. We're all free? Okay, okay. I'll stop lounging around. Does that dog know? Probably doesn't, does it? I guess we all have to go to the surface. There are woods uh, there we can live in, right? Yeah. It 
It's a long walk back to the ruins. Another ice camp. Oh, the spaghetti. Yep. Sans's uh, word search. I wonder. Oh yeah, we could still do the golfing. I'm worried about getting older. I'll stop being a teen. No, I refuse. I'll just invent new numbers, like 20 teen. Mood! <laughs> uh... Hey, Crypt. Don't you think it's kind of scary to think about the fact that after this year, well, after our birthdays, we won't be teenagers anymore? Like, in t like, it's gonna be our last year being teenagers? We'll be 19. That's why. But that's the last year of being a teenager. Mm hmm Oh yeah, the snowman. Ah, I can feel that piece of me has been well taken care of. Hmm? The barriers opened up? Hmm. Then, if it's not too much to ask, could you take that piece of me to the surface? It, I would really appreciate it. Anything for you, bud. There's a notice written very oddly as if the paper was moving while it was written. It says, out to lunch? Mom might have to share her uh, mind with other people now, but she's still my mom. And that's cool. Because, uh, they're made of ice and stuff. What? It's a joke! Laugh at it! <laughs> no. The doctor brought my brought my uh, she brought my wife back from the dead. Son, he seems happy again. Our family is bigger than ever. Now that my wife is combined with sixteen other people. Well, the dad you're gonna have to share them son. like a custody agreement, right? Uh, they, they, well, need, they would need to do like a custody thing because there's like what six what, how, how many people 16 other people yep so like like what about these 16 other families yeah we'll have to deal with that man going back to the ruins for the first time since the game And then we'll head back, uh, we'll see Temi Village, and then we'll be done. Undertale Walking Simulator. We're in the ruins! We're about to go back to home. Man, isn't this weird now? Yeah. <laughs> Tree here. Man, it's been so long. Do you think the bowl of candy is that you toppled over is still toppled over? Oh, probably. We'll check it out if you want. Ah, uh, yes, a monument of your sins. You know... I, I'll say it again. You just said, hey, take more than one. I was just going further with the bit. Mm-hmm. The frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. Yellow names were nice for a while. Next time we should try re a relaxing shade of green. Ribbit, ribbit. Did you ever find this room's fourth frog? I did. Ribbit, ribbit. Say, now that your journey's over, maybe you'll have to listen. You'll have time to listen to me, since most people just press X to skip through my dialogue. That's right. Pressing X. You've really matured, haven't you? Man, maybe I have. 
There's an ant-sized frog in the crack of the wall. It waves at you. The spiders! Ugh. Oh, they don't have any dialogue. The first mouse! E. The rocks. Oh, the rocks. Bags, it's open. Guess I better roll out. Hey, you mind put giving me a push, pumpkin? Okay. Guess I can't push. But you can your, walk. Uh, your noodle arms are too weak. That rock can walk on its own. <laughs> oh, here's the bull. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. You seem like you have grown a, into a thoughtful and con and conscientious person. Whether that was for my advice or not, I'm quite proud, ribbit. Thank you, Mr. Frog. Ugh. A monument to your sins. Look at what you've done. Yeah, what you've done! You Look did at that. what you've done, alright? You've triggered the event. You, you caused did that. you set the you event that. in motion, alright? I was just going uh -huh. through with the event that was pushed yeah, into you motion. Were just going, you were just following orders. Oh, I was just following orders. I was following your orders. I never said I never said take so much candy out of the bowl that it topples over. Nah, I said get two, because we might need the second one for emergency. You selfish prick, do you think you getting two absolves you, you of anything? No, you, don't get to, you don't get to blame this on me. Anyways, we're near where we first fell. We sure are. The dummy. Oh, I can't interact with them. Well, he doesn't want to speak to you. Oh, Toriel's little baby uh, puzzles. Mm -hmm. Just passed here and we'll be where we were. <gasps> the baby! Asriel. Asriel. Don't worry about me. Someone has to take care of these flowers. Friss, please leave me alone. I can't come back. I just can't, okay? Oh, he's a baby. I don't want to break their hearts all over again. It's better if they never see me. Why are you still here? Are you trying to keep me company? Frisk. Hey. Let me ask you a question. First, why did you come down here? Everyone knows the legend, right? Travelers who climb Mount Eva are said to disappear. Frisk, why would you ever climb a mountain like that? Was it foolishness? Was it fate? Or was it because you... Well, only you know the answer, don't you? I know why Olive climbed the mountain. It was a, it wasn't for a very happy reason. Frisk, I'll be honest with you. Olive hated humanity. Why they did, they never talked about it. But they felt very strongly about that. Frisk, mm. you really are different from Olive. In fact, I thought you have some si though you have some similar uh, fashion choices. I don't know why I ever acted like you were the same person. Maybe the truth is, Olive wasn't really the greatest person. Well, Frisk, you're the type of friend I wish I always had. So maybe I was kind of projecting a bit. Let's be honest, I did some weird stuff as a flower. Oh, weird doesn't just like begin to describe what you did. There's one last thing okay. I feel like I should tell you. Frisk, when Olive and I combined our souls together, 
the control over our body was actually split between us. They were the one that picked uh, up their own empty body. And then, when we got to the village, they were the one that wanted to... to use our full power. I was the one that resisted. And then, because of me, we... Well, that's why I ended up as a flower. Frisk? This whole time, I blamed myself for that decision. That's why I adopted the horrible of- that, that horrible view of the world. Kill or be killed. But now, after meeting you, Frisk, I don't regret that decision anymore. I did the right thing. If I killed those humans, we would have had to go- we would have had to wage war against all of humanity. And in the end, everyone went free, right? I still feel kind of sad knowing how long it took. So maybe it wasn't a perfect decision. But you can't regret hard choices your whole life, right? Well, not that I have much of a life left. But that's besides the point. Frisk, thank you for listening to me. You should really go be with your friends now, okay? Oh. And please, in the future, if you ever, uh, see me, don't think of it as me, okay? I just want you to remember me like this. Someone that was your friend for a little while. Oh, and Frisk, be careful up in the outside world, okay? Despite what everyone thinks, it's not as nice as it is in here. There are a lot of flowies out there. And not everything can be resolved by just being nice. Frisk, don't kill, and don't be killed, alright? What's the best you can strive for? Well, see you. Frisk, don't you have anything better to do? And that's the I last line life. of dialogue we hear from him. You know, I kind of knew that we would find him at the very end, but mm. uh, you know, still, it was it was pretty nice. It is nice. Hmm. I'm gonna pause the recording so I don't waste the space on my laptop. We're back. In Temi Village. Oh my god, Whoa. Temi! Tem here, news! Very good! Whoa, Tem here, news! Very good! Yeah, Tem can go oh. free! A pleasant, a pleasing development, no? <laughs> Whoa, if Tems can go on surface, can see a lot of cute human. Everyone just goes for everyone's go free, but Tem, Tem not leave. Tem watch egg. Tem will be happy fam bully. Oh. It's still hard boiled. Hoives! You still have hoives. She's waiting for someone to let her out. Let her out! Mushroom dance, mushroom dance, whatever could it mean? It symbolizes my unbridled happiness. The Yay! government told me they are willing to transplant me outside. Why didn't you smile at my dance? It almost feels a little rude. Oh. It looks Temmie. like the, Temmie has nothing new to say. Temmie Boy. was just Kawig and stuff. Yeah. Alright. We're gonna head back home now. We're gonna go back to the surface.
Man. The flowers are singing in glee. They're echoing, alright. Of course I will ride in a boat to hot to land. Dog. Dancing on the boat is a danger, but good exercise. Hmm. I mean, they're not wrong, I guess. Come again sometime. I won't. Whoops. Flamesman. We're about to leave. Are you ready? <laughs> Maybe not emotionally. The elevator is in use. Well, not emotionally, but it will happen. back to the room with everyone you want to give us a, a one last final sans undertale yes well i mean there's still the credit sequence so maybe it won't be the final one mm. but you'll know when to do it hmm way so we could walk for a new home. Ye. Man, the architecture of this place is kind of nice. Yeah. That's the city down there. Hmm. Let's look at the souls, or the soul area. E. Ah, they're all empty. The coffin is empty? You didn't notice before, but there's something like... Mummy wrappings at the bottom of it. Uh oh. Bye, everyone. They're coming with us outside. <gasps> oh, yeah, that's right. Ready Sorry, to say goodbye? Since we walked past them. Yeah, okay. Yeah. If you leave here, your adventure will really be over. Your friends will follow you out of the underground. 
feel like we're ready. All right. Don't stare directly at the song, it's bad for your eyes. Oh. The the dialogue. Oh my. Isn't it beautiful, everyone? Wow, it's Yo, even crit. better than on TV. Way better than I ever imagined. Frisk, you live with this? The sunlight is so nice, and the air feels. And the air is so fresh. I really feel alive. Hey, Sans! What's the giant ball? We call that the sun, my friend. That's the sun? Wowie! I can't believe I'm finally meeting the sun! I could stand here and watch this for hours. Yes. It is beautiful, is it not? But we should really think about what comes next. Oh, right. Everyone. This is the beginning of a bright new future. An era of peace between humans and monsters. Frisk. I have something to ask of you. Will you act as our ambassador to the humans? Yeah, sure. Yeah! Frisk will be the best ambassador! And I, the great Papyrus, will be the best mascot! I'll go make the first impre a good first impression. Bro. Well, someone's gotta keep him from getting into trouble. See you guys. Man, do I have to do everything? Papyrus, wait. Hey, I'm I want wait up. Alphys to kiss her. God. Whoops. Uh, should I do something? God. Well, gotta go. It seems that everyone is quite eager to set off. Frisk. You came from this world, right? So you must have a place to return to, do you not? What will you do now? Honestly, if, uh, if, okay, so, like, why did I climb this mountain, right? Because everybody knows, so I'm guessing that I don't have anywhere to go to, you know? Okay, so you want to pick the first one? Yeah. Mother. <laughs> what? Chris. really are a funny child. If you had said that earlier, none of this would have happened. It is a good thing you took so long to change your mind. <laughs> well, I suppose... If you really do not have any other place to go, I will do my best to take care of you for as long as you need. Alright? 
Now, come along. Are you gonna hold my hand? <laughs> Everyone is waiting for us. <laughs> Mother. Mom. Cast. It's time to look at the Undertale cast. Let's go. Oh my god. Frog it was made by Toby. Winsome was made by Toby. Mold small. Luke's. Hey, look, it's Mike Wazowski. God. Veg toyed. Migs. Migs up? Nabs the Bluke. Spooky DJ. Hmm. Oh my god, it's Papyrus. Oh my god, it's my Hey, look. Wow. Oh my god, is that Sans Undertale? Uh. No Drake, Ice Cap, semi successful comedian, <laughs> Gift Trot, Doggo, Christmas display, has a seeing eye of his own, Dogami and Dogarusa, by Toby, Lesser Dog, Braider Dog. Found a loving owner! Oh. Hey, look. They're girlfriends! Look. I, oh. <laughs> oh. They're so cute! Oh. Hairy. Mold. By Tammy reluctantly. Well. Washua. Temmy. <laughs> Temmy, Temmy, Temmy. Yeah. Mad Dummy. Shiren. Metaton. Metaton by Toby. Hey look! Hey look! It's it's Burger Pants! He has his legs! He sure does! The most important part of him. <laughs> Vulcan. Sundari plane. Finally confessed. What? I don't! Pyro. <laughs> Muffet. Ew! Boo! Royal Guards by Toby. The gay people. Use your imagination. They are- they are married. Final frog it wins a lot. In... Hey, how would I read that? Ant... Ass... <laughs> well... Astigmatism. Magic. Night night. Taking a well-deserved mm. nap. The amalgamates. Living with their families. That's good. Asgore by Toby. Oh. Monster Kid. Torio by Toby. Oh, Torio! Oh, she She's wants She's running a school. a school! The clouds are shaped like hearts. The end. Oh? Oh, oh? <laughs> oh. Did you really think it was over? Yeah. I mean, we haven't even done the special thanks yet. Oh, God. Ready? Until I'll end all of this for good. Hi, Goldie. Hello. Hi, Goldie. I wanted to come before you ended it to say happy Pride Month on the last day. <laughs> Bro. 
<laughs> this probably pride isn't coming out on Pride! <laughs> I mean, uh, for all of y'all that are- that do not know that- Okay, uh, uh, okay. uh the day that we're recording this is, um, June 30th, June 30th of 2021, so the last day of Pride one. <laughs> I mean, they could guess that based off of what you said. Okay, well, just making it clear for the slow people. Okay. Like myself. Yeah, what if there's MITS fans out there? <laughs> God. <laughs> what if there's MITS enjoyers? I'm so sad. <laughs> okay. Special things. Why is everything trying to kill you? It's all the names! All the supporters that want to kill me! Said happy Pride Month. <laughs> <laughs> They're homophobic! <laughs> Hi, gay! Happy Dang Pride it. Month! We are sashaying with new deals! I don't Jesus. remember the actual quote. Hi, gay! You know what? Hi, I don't gay! Care Happy Pride Month! Oh. We are sashaying with deals! God. I'm pretty sure I touched some of those, but God. didn't get marked for it. Hopes and dreams slap, though. Yeah, it does slap. So how'd it go? Pretty Yours. good. It was pretty good. It was um, mind exp my my mind was exp it was blown. <laughs> um, also kind of upset that uh. What I thought was going on was not actually what went on. What? Yeah, her you theory fell apart at the seams. Yeah. <laughs> what was her? What was your theory, Myth? Um, because of the fact that the uh, the old child of the um, king and queen had the same name that I thought we had, mm -hmm. right? I thought that um, that Azriel just kind of started this time loop where um, uh, even though we were dead somehow you know time looping uh, we everybody forgot who we were we forgot who we were and we would just fall down the hole and have to make the journey all over again <clears throat> all every single time and that we were the original kid that originally died but because of the time loop we would keep coming back mm -hmm. that is all I see. Cause I thought I thought that the name that we gave at the beginning of the of the Shush, game was the cutscene. Oh. Well, cinnamon butter scotch pie. Shut your bitch ass up. <laughs> <laughs> Why on the floor? She did that before. You could easily put a table in there. Put but a there isn't. Table on her? Uh, so you just put it on the floor when there's no table? I mean, yeah. If I if she put it on us, then we would just move and it would fall. She can keep it in the kitchen until we wake up. But she wants to surprise it to you. She wants to give it to you as a surprise in your room. The end. Then she could wait until like around the time that I'm waking up to bring it. That way, it's a surprise and it's in my room. The end. The end. You know, it is the end, huh? Mm -hmm. Undertale is over. It's over. It was really nice. I enjoyed this journey with you. Now it's the genocide run. No, it's not. Hey, hey look. <laughs> Dog. 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 I was gonna say, is that Toby Fox? And I almost said, is that Toby Maguire? <laughs> <laughs> uh, the best Spider Man. Ah. Uh. Goldie. He was trying to te like talk to me about oh, British man. people, and he was like, oh, you remember the Spider Man, right? And I was like, oh, Toby Maguire? <laughs> bro. You did say his name. Oh, sorry, sorry, I forgot. Anyways, Undertale's over. Damn. 
So glad I was here for the beginning, the middle, and the end. You were... <laughs> a reoccurring character, if you will. Yes. A surprise character. I had the thirst, thir third most appearances out of us. Oh, so thank you. He's sleeping! Oh! A baby! Good night, sweet prince. Thanks for the game, I guess, and the mental illness. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, Undertale's over. Uh, Holy. yeah. I don't think we have plans to do the genocide run. Um, you can do that with Goldie later if you want. I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to see people die. Uh, you say you don't want to see people die, but then you watch the Let's Play. Um... Also, oh, aren't you the one that also said play? that these aren't people? Yeah, you did say okay. several times during the... Listen... Yeah, they're not real people, but it still makes me feel bad when they feel bad. Okay. Anyways, it's the end of Undertale. Uh, you know, the likes, the comments, the subscribes, the give me money through various means such as Kofi and Redbubble, even though I have nothing in Redbubble right now. <laughs> Bye. Thank you. I'm gonna continue eating this Pocky. Hooray. Mm. I am not going to spare you. During what? genocide of humanity. Oh! My humanity I genocide run. <laughs> Anyways, bye! Goodbye! Bye.